Tubers Mezcal here. Today's plan is to get some new hoses, replace the hoses. I want to um, clean this surface up here and put down uh, some sort of some sort of coating that'll lift that up a little bit because I've taken like this paint is on fairly thick and there's you know a bit of material I've sanded off cleaning that up and when you when you look at the, the seal that comes down probably the wrong side to be looking at okay, the, the light on the back side there uh, it does look good but a little a little layer around there will help protect the aluminium and you know um, increase the the ceiling a bit sus on this thing I found one for fourteen dollars from Hong Kong um, I might replace that too I'm applying uh, the 3d printer resin with graphite or graphene intercalated graphite and um, I'll cure that on there that should be a good uh, industrial coating I think that looks good I'm gonna hit it with the laser activate the curing laser curing laser activated This is a 1200 grit diamond wheel. We'll use that to lap that top. Get that all nice and smooth. Just wetting it and grinding it. You can see the flat spots where the um, high points are. Put that on the, the middle to make it easier to handle. taking quite some time but it's doing a good job come on focus it was taking too long with the uh, 1200 so I went to the 600 grit and I'm getting there it's actually looking really nice I'm happy with that surface finish I've built it up, polished it down to a nice mirror shine. See if I can catch that reflection. There you go, look at that. It's 1200 grit. Using one of these cutting wheels, gem cutting wheels. It's nice and flat, so it, and it fit perfectly over the top, so I was just able to rub it around. It was really easy to work with because I was able to, any low points that weren't high enough, I could just apply another little, like, because it's ultraviolet setting, I could pull the um, machine just into the shade. And I'm right on the edge of the shade here, so pull it into the shade, put a few uh, dabs or drops where they needed to be to build it up, move it back out into the sun, it cures in five minutes, I can start sanding again, and you can't even see where the... Um, where the high points and the low points of the extra pieces were put in. Somewhere over here there was a, a low point. Pretty happy with that. That should seal really nicely. That mirror surface. 